AAC stands for Augmentative Alternative Communication. So if you've had any experience of not being able to communicate even for a short term, um, it's very, it is very frustrating when people don't understand you. So the type of system and the type of way that we're working with these children here is to get them to be independent, intentional communicators and not be placed in the role of a responder. Isabella is six and a half years old. Um, she has a syndrome. It is called Pallister-Killian syndrome, PKS for short. Well, we've been coming to Cook Children's since um, before Willie was born. Our very first appointment was when I was still pregnant with him. We just started using the AAC device back in August. Um, she immediately gave us a great response. Got it. When I heard that Cook's had a therapist that does training on the eye gaze device, I started to submit um, requests to insurance and to Medicaid and to his neurologist to please help us get into this <laughs> because I really had a feeling that Willie could communicate and that this was the way that he was going to be able to do it. And it turns out that it worked. It's incredible to see her choose a word and we can reinforce it. Just those basic needs that you know an individual has, you, you want someone to know, you want to be able to communicate and that's, that's really helped us. Going into this journey six and a half years and not being able to have your six-year-old communicate with you, that's hard. Hearing mom for the first time was something that I'll never forget. It was a wonderful moment. Mom. Oh, <laughs> mom is right there, you're right. The next step is we wanna add dad. Dad doesn't always get to come to appointments with us, but that's our next goal. And so he gets to experience that. So when you start having the child demonstrate what they are thinking in a manner that they can be understood, the, it, it just, for lack of better words, it just makes the family happy. Because all of a sudden this child is something more than they thought they could be. I really hope that as he gets older and more um, adept at using this eye gaze device that communicating with Willie will be a lot easier and not so much of a guessing game. We're just appreciative of our relationship with Cook Children's, with our therapists, with our doctors. It's been a wonderful thing to have um, the medical center and your organization on our side and supporting us as parents along the way.